Hey guys, Alicia from Love Letter Generation. Hope you're all doing well. I'm on here with a AliExpress haul to share with you today. And these are some new items that I have never purchased before. And yeah, I thought I'd share them with you. I will leave all the links down below and um, yeah, to make it easier for you guys to find them. So, first I might actually start with the dies. So, I ended up grabbing this cute little die here. So, you get like a little frame or a couple of little frames and then this beautiful little flower um, that you could embellish and layer up and then you could pop the little flower embellishment onto the frame there. And I thought that was so adorable. So petite. So it's going to be perfect for your smaller projects and embellishing, um, you know, like rosettes or any other small embellishments. And I love that you get the square as well as the oval shape. And then you've got a couple of leaves there as well that you can add um, to the flower. So that's really cute, that one. And then this die here, I actually found out, or I found this through my good friend Anna, who is creatively blessed. And this is a cute horse die. And when she showed me this, I thought it would be perfect to use with my favourite Maggie Holmes collection, Gather. I think the bag's a bit broken, so I'll just slide it out through that way. And it would also um, be perfect for Style Board, which is one of Maggie Holmes' original um, collections, as well as Market Square. But yeah, as soon as I saw it, I thought gather straight away um, and market square. So very cute die. You get the three different types of um, horses there, depending on what you're wanting to go for. So that's a cute one. I love that you get three and they're reasonably priced. <laughs> So next I will go into um, some charms that I grabbed. I ended up grabbing, again for Gather, some little ballerina charms. So they're gold. And you get so many of them in the pack. I think it's like a pack of 50. And again, very cheap, so... Um, that's always handy and because they are gold you can basically um, add them with any other color you like so little ballerinas they look very bright on camera at the moment but they're just like a nice normal gold color I think it's just the lighting in here today because the sun's actually out So you get 50 of those, just pop that there to the side, and then we have um, some little seahorse charms, which I thought were really cute. I'm wanting to get a lot more sort of um, summery, ocean, beach sort of themed bits and pieces, because I don't actually have a whole lot in my stash so if I'm ever working with like sunny days and tropical sort of collections or doing some happy mail beach themed I wanted some cute little bits and pieces so I found these cute little pink seahorse charms I think they are adorable and they're gold and again, you get a really good amount in here. Um, I have a feeling it could be around 20, 
possibly even more there because no it might be a 20 pack by the looks of it so those are extremely cute and they came in other colors but of course I had to get them in pink <laughs> I don't think I've got any more up my sleeve there. Um, next we have, oh, now these are pretty. I almost bought more the other day, actually. I'm glad I didn't because, you know, when you forget that you've actually purchased something and I was going to buy a whole bunch of pink ones of these, but it looks like I grabbed the variety pack where you get a mix of pink and white. Um, flower charms and these are really pretty I think they're gorgeous they've got like a nice looking um, gold piece in the middle there so you get a pack of oh I was thinking 10 but it might be a pack of 12 because I can see six pink and six white so yes pack of 12 so yeah, six each of the different colors there I didn't want to have just all pink so I thought the pink and white were two nice colors to have and they are really pretty And then next, I have these butterfly charms. These are very different to what I thought they would be or what they looked like, I should say, on, um, on the images on Ali, but they're still pretty. And I grabbed a variety pack in this one as well of all the different colored butterflies. I just wanted to have um, some different butterfly charms compared to my usual. So let's just see what colors we've got in here. So we've got blues, yellow, pink, and then like a paler sort of pink, like a lilac almost color. And they have a nice shine to them and I liked the shape so I thought they were quite pretty and I believe you get let me just see two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen that's odd maybe it is twenty oh yeah I've dropped some so twenty sorry I just can't count <laughs> So yeah, 20 butterfly charms. And from memory, I believe these were a really good price as well. Just put some of them over there. I love how they shine. They are so pretty. Okay, next we have some cute little high heel charms. And I grabbed a variety pack in these as well. So you've got white high heels, black ones, and pink. Two different shades of pink by the looks of it. So they are really cute. I'm just trying to show you so you kind of get an idea of the, the shape there. They are cute. See so it's too black, too white, too pink and like too lilac sort of color. So what's that one? Two, four, six, eight. 
eight little heels. So cute. And I don't have anything like this at all in my um, collection. So yeah, all of these things here are things that I have never purchased. They're all new to me. So they're very cute. Then we have these floral charms here. They look like little pink roses. And they've got like a little, um, like little cubic zirconias in them. And I believe this is a 10 pack. And these are really pretty. So I hope the lighting is doing them justice. They are gorgeous. All right, what do we have next? Oh, we have some of those cute little balloon dog, um, like balloon animal charms in the dog. So I grabbed them in gold because I just wanted them to be versatile so they can go with any colour theme or project. Oh, this one's got a little spiky bit hanging off of him. What is going on there? Two of them are looped up in some wire by the looks of it. So not that one. But yeah, you can see the little, little balloon dogs. So they're cute. And I believe you get 10 of those in a pack. They come in other colours as well, but like I said, I wanted to get the gold. So it just goes with any other colours. I was eyeing off the pink and I'm like, no, I only need... The gold ones <laughs> and this one's got a weird bit of metal has been wrapped around him so I'll have to get that off later next we have these little cuties here so these are like little pink and white mushrooms which I thought were absolutely adorable and they're probably um the better sort of mushroom charms that I have seen on Ellie because I've been looking at a whole heap for ages and umming and ahhing about which ones to grab. And then I found these ones and I'm like, yep, that's them. So they are really cute. So they're gold, pink and white little mushrooms and they are adorable. I am a huge mushroom lover. I just love my mushrooms. The vegetable, that is, I should state. <laughs> so how cute are they? Love them. And they're a beautiful sort of pale pink, I guess, lilac sort of colour. So really pretty. And I believe they came in other colours as well. But I only like to spend my money on the things that I know I'm going to use and love and that they're really pretty and to my taste. Otherwise, yeah, I'm not going to, to buy them. So next I grabbed something very different, but I thought they were really cool. These are like little UFOs. Um, or little flying saucers, whatever you want to call them. So some people call them UFOs and some people call them flying saucers. So. And they're in gorgeous colours. They're a good size and they've got the beam. And let me see, it looks like you get six. 
I think they're a little bit pricier than, than the other ones because you get the six and they're a lot bigger. But I thought these were so fun. And I loved the colours on there. Just thought they were really interesting. Something different to have in my stash. And then I grabbed something else really cute and very different, kind of like the UFOs. But I want a bit of, you know, variety, a um, little bit of everything that I can sort of go to when I need it. So just cleaning up all these little bits of confetti everywhere. I ended up grabbing these cute little fry pans that have an egg in it. I thought they were so cute. So they'd be really good to go with any themed um, mail that you're doing. Like if you're doing a food theme, they'd go with like a lot of um, Obed Marshall's collections where he's got a lot of food related um, collections, which I just said, I keep repeating myself. How cute are they? I thought they were adorable. So I just had to have them. I sent the little fried egg in the pink fry pan. It's so cute. And you get a good amount. I believe you get 10. So absolutely love those. And I bought all these from the same shop, actually, all these charms. I believe they were from Julie Wang on Alley. Um, except for these ones. These ones came from a different supplier on Alley, and they actually took forever to get here. I have ordered more, though, but just in the pink. But to begin with, I wanted to start with a variety pack I thought they were really pretty they're a good size um, they'd be really nice to dangle off of some projects they almost look like a waffle sort of looking um, resin heart charm so I thought they were really pretty and I've got some more coming in the pink. So that's it for the charms. And then yesterday, while I was at work all day, I had a bit of a look around before the shop opened and in Spotlight. And I just found a couple of other goodies that I wanted to grab. So I thought I'd just share those with you guys as well. So I ended up finding this beautiful mint sort of green trim. I'm just trying to see if it says what size or color. It does not. <laughs> it's by Simplicity. Simplicity.com, so hopefully they probably have a website where you can buy all this. Um, but yeah, it doesn't tell me what the colour is, but to me it's a beautiful mint green colour. So I thought that would be really nice to have in my trim stash and to create with. And it's just like your little pom-pom sort of type um, trim. So I thought that'd be fun to pop onto some embellishments. And I grabbed some in the pink colours the other day, which you'll see um, in my previous haul video. So I grabbed that. And then I found this, which I thought 
was really pretty. I had seen it in Spotlight before. I just never grabbed it. Um, but this time I'm like, no, this is going to look so gorgeous layered up onto the back of um, like embellishments and projects. So it's a really, really pretty gold um, and it's, it's like a thicker quality um, polyester. So I just thought that would look really nice. And this is by Milford. Um, it's called Old Gold. And you get three. Oh, I think it's three millimeters the size. And you get, I think, 170 meters of it, which. Well, it says 20 grams, but yeah, it works out to be, I think, 170 meters, which is a really good amount. So this will last me for quite some time. So, yeah, that's really pretty, that one. And then I just went and grabbed myself a new um, storage container, only this one has the smaller containers compared to the ones that I get from Kmart for my sequin mixes. So this one's from Spotlight and it just has the smaller like screw jars here for your smaller bits and pieces. So I thought that this one would be great to put all my little like diamond dots in. So I've been collecting these out of the diamond gem packs or paintings that you can get. And I'm going to pop all the colours that I like into these little, little jars. So I thought that would be handy for that. And it's a 24 pack. So you fit a good amount in there. So, and I believe this is usually $16, but yeah, I got it a bit cheaper, so... Um, there we go, guys. There's my recent haul. Hopefully I get to do some crafting soon. I've just been absolutely flat out. I've been working every day and yeah, life's just a lot busier lately. <laughs> so, um, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed these videos and I'll, um, catch you on the next one. Take care. Bye.